Today's video podcast addresses a specific question sent in by a subscriber. The question, or more truly questions, are what are the implications of a listing agreement expiring during or after a contract is submitted? Is a listing agent still representing the seller even though the contract hasn't closed? Often the seller doesn't want to extend the listing agreement. The answer to that question points to the Texas Realtors Residential Real Estate Listing Agreement Exclusive Right to Sell, which specifically provides that a broker's compensation is earned when, during the listing, the seller sells, exchanges, options, or agrees to sell the property to anyone at any price on any term. And then the agreement states, once earned, Broker's compensation is payable either during this listing or after it ends at the closing and funding of the sale or exchange. This listing agreement is binding between seller and listing agent and specifically provides for payment of commission once earned even after the listing agreement expires. Rarely do I get questions about payment of commission in this scenario. Where I really receive a lot of questions occurs when the broker during the listing procures a buyer ready, willing, and able to buy. But perhaps the contract is not yet negotiated or is in the process of being negotiated when the listing expires and the seller does not want to extend it. Technically, when the listing expires, the agent is no longer to serve as agent of the seller. That means the agent can no longer hold him or herself out as an agent of the seller, nor can the agent advertise the property as a listing of theirs on their website, Facebook page, or otherwise, and the agent must remove any signage of the property. However, the agent is still entitled to the commission if that contract closed with that procured buyer under that provision that says earn compensation if an agent has procured a buyer ready, willing, and able to buy the property at the listing price or any other price acceptable to the seller. So although the listing agreement has expired, if compensation is earned under the provision for procuring a buyer, the agent is to be paid upon the closing. Another provision of the listing agreement can preserve the agent's right to payment of commission after expiration of the agreement. That is that protection period under which even after the agreement expires, the agent can give a list of buyers' names who expressed interest in the property during the listing and if those buyers buy the property within a negotiated period of time, commission is earned and payable. Remember, under the protection period, names of buyers must be sent to the seller within 10 days of the expiration of the listing agreement to preserve this right under the protection period. The protection period will not apply, however, if seller lists the property with another Texas realtor and seller is obligated to pay that broker commission on that sale. So back to the question submitted. If a listing agreement expires and the seller does not choose to extend it, the listing agent will still have the right to receive commission for fees earned prior to expiration of the listing or protection period if a protection period is applicable. However, once the listing agreement expires, the agent can no longer hold himself out as agent of the seller and must quit advertising the property and uh, take out any yard signs. If you have further questions or another topic you would like addressed, please send an email to me at tipoftheweek at allegiancetitle.com. In the meantime, if Allegiance Title can be of assistance to you or your clients, please call on us. We want to be your trusted resource for results. Thank you and stay well.